Welcome to the TruePoint 300 Quick Start Guide using the QuickMap 3D application running on Android operating system. Make sure your Android device is running on Android 4.1 or later. Typically, you can find out what version of OS or operating system you're using in your system settings. Our first step is to install the QuickMap 3D application onto your Android device. In order to do that, we need to turn on your Wireless Local Area Network, or WLAN. To begin, navigate to your Settings menu and locate the Display icon. Set the Sleep option to Never or a Long Duration. We don't want the screen going dark while mapping. Next, select WLAN as your wireless network and select the wireless network you want to connect to. At this point in time, you may also want to set up an email account for sending QuickMap 3D reports. Now we're ready to install QuickMap 3D. Open up Google Play on your Android tablet or phone. Search for LaserSoft QuickMap and tap to select it from the results. Tap Install and enter your Play Store password if necessary. If you do not already have a Google Play account, you will be prompted to create one. It only requires an email address and password. When you open the Quick Map app for the first time, a short video will play, and then a screen will appear requesting a license key to confirm proof of purchase. Tap and hold on the machine ID to copy the ID number or notate the machine ID. You will need this ID number to get your license key. Tap the License Manager website link. You should have received a temporary password from licensing at lasertechpartners.com via email. Enter your email address and temporary password. Enter your machine ID. If you copied it to the clipboard, simply tap and hold to paste it into the machine ID entry field. Next, copy the purchase ID from the purchase table above. Tap and hold the Purchase ID in the Purchases table and select the Copy option. In order to paste the Purchase ID, tap and hold the Purchase ID field and select the Paste option. Click Submit and your license key will display below the entry fields as well as in the Purchases table above. Copy or jot down your license key and return to QuickMap. Paste or type the key into the Enter License Key field and tap Start. First, we need to turn on the WLAN communication on the TruePoint 300. Begin by pressing the Fire icon to power on the unit. Now, press the Function button and tap the Settings icon. This will lead you to the Wi-Fi connectivity display. Tap the Wi-Fi icon twice to activate your WLAN connectivity. Select WLAN, tap the arrow, or press C slash off to accept your selection. Next, you will need to change the units of measure to feet. Start by pressing the function and then tap the settings icon. Simply tap the unit icon twice to change the unit of measure. Tap the arrow or press C slash off to accept your selection. Now you will need to connect the TruePoint 300 to your tablet over WLAN. Simply tap the Settings icon and then tap WLAN. Under the Available Devices tab on your tablet, you will select the laser model or serial number, in this case, the TruePoint 300. The tablet will establish the connection and then list the TruePoint 300 as connected. You have successfully connected your TruePoint 300 to your tablet over WLAN. This step must be done prior to mapping any survey. When setting up your first shot with the TruePoint 300, make sure to first power on all components. Remember to check your tablet settings to verify the TruePoint 300 is connected over WLAN. Now, tap the Quick Map 3D icon on your home screen to launch the program. Once you are on the Quick Map 3D main screen, choose to start a new survey. Enter a survey file name and then tap the drop down arrow to the right of Device to choose TruePoint 300 from the list of devices. 
The method needed will be radial with angle. Select the units that match what is set on the laser. Note, if you are measuring in 3D, enter in the instrument height. If you would like the data collected to be stored in 3D, check the box. Otherwise, it will be automatically stored in 2D. Now, enter the height of the non-reflective target, or if measuring directly to the feature, leave the target height at zero. Simply tap Next to move to the Set Origin screen where you will set the origin or instrument position for your scene. First, tap the laser connection icon at the top of the screen to establish communication between the laser and Quick Map. The icon will change from No Connection to Connected, with a green or yellow battery depending on the current battery level in the laser. Once communication is established, the true point will prompt for its leveling routine. Bring the laser horizontal so that the digital bubbles appear in the green area. Then, it will beep and automatically move to the next step when it is satisfied. Next, rotate the true point to reduce the green area until it beeps. Rotate the true point a second time, reducing the green until the true point beeps to complete the leveling routine. The laser main screen will display. Look back to the tablet to complete the set origin screen. Regarding the XYZ coordinates for instrument position, there are two options. You can choose to keep the default values of 0.00, .00 which is typical, or if you know the coordinates for your instrument position, you have the option of entering them. Now, zero the true point on your reference. You can zero on north or any target of your choice. Aim the true point at your reference point using the red dot or the camera. Tap Shoot to Reference to zero the true point on your reference point. Angle zeroed will display to indicate the angle has been zeroed correctly. Simply tap Next to continue to the data collection screen and begin mapping. Tap Remote Fire to add the reference point to your map. Enter Ref for a description before tapping Submit to finish adding the point to your survey. Continue shooting in the rest of the data points in the scene until your map is complete. Thanks for watching this quick start guide on using the TruePoint 300 with Quick Map Android. To learn more about laser technology products and solutions, please visit us at lasertech.com.